Hey, it's Brianna for Triumph and Tuesdays. This week we're finishing up our rotation and we're going to be talking about how recovery has to start with you because ultimately you have to do your own work and nobody can do it for you. So I'll start off this video by saying that a few years ago I got stuck in a hurricane. Yes, you heard right, I got stuck in a hurricane. Real fun. Well anyway, me, my sister, and my mom had planned this girls trip to Hilton Head and they had threatened a hurricane, but we didn't really believe them. And besides, nothing was going to stop this girl's trip because it had been planned forever. So we drove there. It was fine. The first day was fine. The second day was really, really incredibly beautiful. The sun was shining. It was warm. It was perfect. Sand looks beautiful. It was great. We were just chilling, talking to each other. When all of a sudden, out of nowhere, the hurricane started. It went from a perfect day to 15 mile an hour winds with sand brushing at my back, slamming me. I literally felt like sand was being slammed at my face by some kind of gun. It was really scary. And my mom was like, we gotta leave, we gotta leave. And I was like, I can't, I can't, mom, mom I can't do it. And she said something very wise that I will never forget. She told me that it didn't matter whether I thought I could or I thought I couldn't, I had to. I had to get out of the hurricane and she told me to pray she said pray Brianna pray to which I responded oh yeah father son holy spirit dear heavenly father I serve a god that moves mountains and I need some mountains moved immediately so you better figure it out oh yeah thanks and we started walking and I didn't think I could do it and I was really really scared and sand just kept pelting in my face harder and harder and harder and the winds uh, well we were going against the wind so it was really really scary and I don't know how to describe it other than that but eventually thank God we got out of it now this has many parallels to recovery because essentially we all have to get out of the hurricane and I think that recovery can happen when you decide that you're gonna get out of the hurricane and it doesn't matter how and it doesn't matter what happens or how hard it is you're going to get out of it and I think that's when recovery can happen when it doesn't matter whether you think you can or whether you think you can't you just realize that you have to and this happened several years after I recovered but it has allowed me to explain how I think recovery happens so I'm really grateful for that experience but ultimately, guys, you have to do your own work. And there are so many tools along the way, but therapists, other treatment providers, the We Are Freedom Fighters team, anybody who you reach out to are like Google Maps. We can tell you where to go and we can give you an idea on how to get there, but ultimately, you have to do the driving. You have to want it. You have to free yourself. You have to do the work. I can't take this journey for you. I can help you along the way. But ultimately, it has to come from you. And you know what? If you tweet me or Facebook me, if you're friends with me on Facebook, or you leave a comment on one of my Instagram photos or a comment on this video, I will be the first to come and help you because I love helping people that want to be helped. It's my passion. It's what I want to do in life. I want to be a therapist. but. I realize that unless you would want, unless you want to be helped, I can't help you. So you have to want it and you have to get out of the hurricane, like in my story. You have to realize that if you want it enough and you believe that you can get out of it and you do it in whatever way is possible for you, like I've said so many times, it doesn't matter how you recover, it just matters that you got there then you can recover. But ultimately, it has to start with you. Have a wonderful week, guys. See you next time. Bye.